<laughs> oh, this Iron Head 41. Here is a big 50 inch Sony television. Uh, it went out a long time ago. Should have never bought it. It's one of them projectors. Uh, I'm going to take it apart. I want the uh, lens out of it. I'm going to make some type of a solar cooker. And uh, to where there's no fuel, no wood, only using sunshine. And uh, let's open this thing up with a screwdriver and let's see what kind of lens is so there. I'm assuming that's the lens you're talking about. It does have something funky in it. And I broke it. Oh, yes I did. Try to be a man, jerk it apart off of this dark cover lens. And I should have took a knife and went around the edges and cut it apart because it's sewn together. Hmm. Well, let's just wait till the sun's out tomorrow and see how that works. All right. Uh, this is actually called a Fresnel lens out of a big TV projector. Uh, it's very brittle. I done broke the corner off of it. What I got is I got a can of water and it is 70, about 74 degrees. Take your Fresnel lens and point it toward the sun. And there is a certain way to turn it. Something like that. Well, let me flip it over. See if that's any better. I'm really not getting a point, which at first now may be not as good as probably a smaller one. I think this one's too big. It's too uh, widespread. Or maybe I need to back away. I don't know. Not what move, dog? Don't let me burn your eyeballs. Well, I don't know how far I need to be or close. Getting closer. I see, I see daylight. <laughs> to use this, you would have to build a huge apparatus to where this would go up and down and left to right and follow the sun. You'd have to constant attention here. Well, you can see the light shining on it pretty good, but so I got my hand in the light. You can feel heat, but it's nothing like uh, it's not enough to burn wood or boil water, probably. I can't find a, the further I get away, the light spreads out. And the closer I get to it, then the light spreads out again. So there's a focal point of about right there, which is about two foot away from it. Well, this is a prep tech fail. <laughs> all right, how you like that? All right, well, all is not lost with the Fresno, Fres, Fresnel trial here. I, it, it, this one here is just not clear enough to have a pretty good focal point. So this is my pump house uh, where we store some bleach and hummingbird stuff. I duct taped it. And of course the sun is going away fast. I duct taped it to the inside. And I tell you what, there is, it's warmer right here. Let me back up a little bit, go up a little high. There, there's a couple of degrees difference. Uh, that thing, that little panel there could give me some solar heat in the cold evenings, you know, and keep my pump house from freezing. <laughs> so all is not lost. It doesn't have a focal burning point, but you can feel the heat. Look at my hand, the, the daylight difference. Cool, huh? Isn't that cool? I guess you can see right here at the center. Oh, that's some good heat right there. I can feel it right on my hand. <laughs> well, that's it.